At this time of the year, uh, everything is going on sale. Like today is 26th of December. So we are ready to go for Boxing Day. The first year when I came to Canada, when I heard about Boxing Day, you guys gonna laugh at me. I thought that day people play boxing. That's right. This is what I thought it's gonna be. Pe people play boxing on boxing day but no it it's not like that the boxing day means like there is a sale <laughs> like most of the clearance item goes for extra 20 percent off extra 30 percent off or extra 50 percent off now i i know if you live in canada you know all of that but this video is like this part of the video is most likely for people uh, around the world that ask uh, how do we celebrate the, you know, end of the year in here, um, especially in Mauritius, people have asked. So uh, today is 26th of December, yesterday was 25th and everything was closed. Um, so today the stores open, some stores open like 6 o'clock, uh, some 7 o'clock some probably regular hour um so right right now we are ready and uh let's it's just like fun i like to see like what's the deal we bake some croissant to take with us and look how gorgeous they are now this is from costco frozen uh, uh croissant the french croissant mm. a little too much so we have a spring roll chicken spring rolls and uh, so this burning one is mine like i like those burning one the tired woman look at me i'm tired i just came from boxing day playing box. <laughs> playing boxing <laughs> so did you have fun too many people boxing day <laughs> way too many I, i'm tired I played so many boxing. I'm exhausted. <laughs> and I didn't buy nothing. You know, it was the first time when I heard about Boxing Day, I thought really people play boxing, but it's not. <laughs> yeah, people box in the stores over items. <laughs> That's why it's called Boxing Day. They fight each other over items. You hungry? Starving. Okay, so John is hungry. I'm gonna go make some chicken shawarma. Okay, so I came and I cleaned all my counter after frying. <laughs> he has a pink plate. <laughs> so I fried um, spring rolls <laughs> this morning. So I, uh, the oil and everything was spilling. So I cleaned up everything. And uh, now I am going to make dinner because Mr. is hungry. yeah so i just came after lunch i went outside a little bit i'm at work right now when i came on my desk i see a ice cream cake this is how my husband celebrate my birthday of every year surprising me my husband surprised me at work for an ice cream cake and he knows he knows I like Dairy Queen. Bought some fork and some little cups. Unbelievable. Why did you do uh, that? Can, can you come in a little piece inside that bowl so I can go to work? <laughs> I think I eat too much cake. It was a strawberry cheesecake, ice cream cheesecake. 
cheesecake ice cream. It's a strawberry ice cream cake. It's strawberry ice cream cake. It's strawberry is my favorite at all time. I would eat a strawberry ice cream like all the time. I will never get tired. Yes, I do like Oreo as well, but number one is always strawberry. Yo, where are you going like this? Winners. <laughs> like this? Yeah. Curious. Like this? I don't owe anybody money. <laughs> I know you don't owe anybody money. So, don't so why you have to go like this? Yeah. Summertime. It's not summer. It's it's December thirty first. It feels like summer. It's plus ten. So we are going out a little bit. Can you dress up? I'm ready. No, you're not. I'm ready to go. I just need my slippers. So it is thirty first of December. By the time I post this vlog on YouTube, it's gonna be probably first of January. I'm gonna try. If not, then second. Like we'll see. So if I'm done this vlog today, I'm gonna like edit it tomorrow so we woke up this morning john already did laundry he did two load of laundry he cleans the house completely he did an extra cleaning as he always do but today he did extra extra cleaning and uh, so we are going out a little bit so i have to buy a little bit of stuff that i need for my uh, cooking so i'm gonna do a lot of cooking today including some samosa i want to make some chicken samosa and just put them in the freezer. So lots of dishes over there that I have done. I cleaned my counter, I did some dishes. I'm gonna put them away later when they get dry. Uh, one thing I don't like is those uh, holders, uh, you know, the dishes holder to leave on the counter. I just don't like it. I just wanna see my counter neat and clean. And uh, once I did, I done my dishes, I let them dry or I wipe them off and then put them back in the cabinet so um that's the way i like it i don't like too much stuff i still think there's still too much stuff on my counter like i want to remove everything when i do a whole uh, uh kitchen tour then i can explain everything what i have in and out uh up and down um things like that so the other day we went to costco and i saw this fireplace it's it's kind of what john has in the basement right now but this one is uh like four inch uh this is a 54 inch for his is 50 inch a wall mount electric fireplace so um yeah guys you know you can see like in canada canada is bilingual so everything in the box that has to be written is in english and french so you can see it has to be english and french so this is all the items that you buy here in Canada is written English and French, just like in Mauritius. I have a corner fireplace. That's a corner one. So let me just come close so you can see what I'm trying to say. So that's a corner one, which takes me so long to get one that is a corner. And now I feel like I wanna change it. I need more room because um, I just, this is just a sitting area, so uh, for guests. But when we watch movie, we just go to John basement downstairs, which is his man cave. So what I am trying to do right now is, this fireplace is going in this wall over here. I'm gonna remove this couch. I'm gonna move it to the other side. And then the TV is going on the wall over here. But the person, Michael, is our friend and our contractor. He is not uh, free right now to come and do this. So hopefully we're going to get this in January. I was hoping to get it before January 1st, but it's not going to happen. So um, I feel like this TV a little bit blocks the window and I don't want that. I, I just want this window to be free. But then what? This couch is going over there. But it's still I can see the whole window. But yeah, I'm gonna do a transforming in this uh, living area, and I'm gonna like show show you guys when it's time what I'm gonna do and how it's gonna looks like. Also, this makeup table right here in the corner it does looks nice, but I'm planning on moving it on this side by removing this uh, armoire. So if I remove this armoire and this desk is coming on this side let me just move 
on this side so you guys can see and uh, don't mind my laundry basket I have to put my clothes away later so yeah this is going here my desk and then this mirror probably i'm gonna have to move it in the corner but i'm not sure about this one but for the living room for sure we are moving things but i'm not sure then because i have this drawer right here which is not gonna fit in this area so then i have to put the drawer facing this way so i don't know i don't know what to do i'm still thinking of what to do with this uh vanity makeup table move it or don't move it we'll see later you guys know john quit is smoking and then he started vaping uh so now he's trying to stop vaping as well but it this is like getting hard for him he can't do it he just went out um i just stopped by for him to go get his juice like they use some kind of fruit juice or cake juice um so yeah he went to get his juice so he can vape at the same time he's trying to quit and you guys can see the weather raining and the rain calmed down a little bit but it's gonna be like this all day all night so we came to winners right now and uh, i was thinking of getting one of these i never owe one of this french press um but i'm thinking of like planning on should i should i not or maybe should i get just a small size okay so oh, this one looks pretty 19.99 plus tax everything you buy here in canada is plus tax except food like and food i'm not talking about like chips what happened to my hair over here i'm not talking about chips stuff like that i'm talking about like rice milk those kind of stuff does it have uh, tax so um i was watching tiktok this morning and i saw a video of finally we have halal kfc in mississauga we can't believe we find halal kfc in canada it's been so long since I have eaten KFC and they have halal certificate um, and I did ask them if they made it separately like in a separate uh, you know like the processing is all separately and proof of halal and everything now I'm ready to eat KFC and John we ordered the the food and then he just went went to wash his hand and he is like so excited to eat it after so long fries my favorite some pieces of kfc macaroni salad john is dripping he's excited he's been over 10 years he already gets the pieces of chicken and can't wait right it's been over 10 years since i have kfc <laughs> I can't see fries. I always just start with fries. No other one. Uh, I love fries. This is so bad. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, so we uh, eat KFC already and then now I'm doing little shopping and there is like 50% off everywhere trying to take advantage. So we already came home from the little shopping that we did, actually that I did, and after eating KFC for lunch. So now I am making a little bit of pule badam which is uh, almond chicken. So I'm doing a little shortcut. It's not exactly same ingredient, but the way I made in the YouTube, on my YouTube channel, I already posted, it's not the same. So let me just show you, give you an idea what I'm doing. So um, in this bowl, I have my chicken pieces and this time I'm using only chicken breast. And then I had add my yogurt, ginger, garlic paste, uh, all the spices, 
a um, little bit of turmeric chili everything garam masala and everything what you see on my youtube channel that i posted the almond chicken pulle obadam the same thing so this one i'm doing a shortcut because uh, I just feel like doing a shortcut. So I'm just gonna mix everything. Okay, so um, I just bought this pot Today and uh, I have been looking for this pot for so long. It is like wide. It is large in the bottom. It is the, Just the way I like it and so so excited and I'm gonna go make my pulley badam in here today and also here I'm making some uh, chicken samosa going on right now. This is a filling for it. Almost done. I don't know if I'm gonna roll them today or tomorrow. So I have my almond boiling here on one side and in my pot, my new pot, I'm uh, frying some onion. The onion is looking good. And now for some gravy, I'm gonna add one large onion that I have blended to paste. And then I'm gonna stir that cook this little bit with this onion and then I'm gonna go peel the almond and make a paste by adding a little bit of water now I add a little bit of spices which is coriander garam masala chili powder turmeric cinnamon and cardamom and now you can see how the fried onion and the onion paste has cooked and it's looking yummy and now I'm gonna add my chicken in here chicken is in and now I'm gonna give it a good mix and let the chicken cook in 15 minutes so if your chicken does not release water then you're gonna add a little bit of water if you want to follow this recipe um, you can check the ingredient down below in the description box but not here it's already posted um, like maybe two months ago that I posted the pulle badam chicken almond recipe so now I add my, my almond paste and then I'm gonna stir and let it cook and if I need water, I think I do need water so I'm just gonna add some water in my blender so I can get the, you know, the leftover almond. We need some gravy because I'm eating this with naan, we are eating this with naan. So uh, the naan recipe also posted, but I'm not adding garlic. So you can use the same uh, basic recipe for the garlic naan. Just do not add garlic, just use a dough. Cheers! Happy New Year! <laughs> yeah, at 11.42. <laughs> Everybody wants to sleep. 12 minutes, we're not going to make it. Oh, this is so good. I don't like this at all. I like it. It's an sugar. organic, non-alcoholic yeah. champagne. 15 pounds of sugar. I'm going to be up all night drinking water. <laughs>